Wait, did you know that they're making Twister 2? Yeah, that would be scary as hell. I wonder where they're going to film it because are they going to put the actual uh, of a storm? Probably like Tornado Alley, so like yeah. southern Midwest, Tennessee, Oklahoma, somewhere like that. Because they're not going to do it in like California or anything like that. That'd be pointless. No, but there ain't no tornadoes in California. They have heat waves. And yeah, but they have uh, earthquakes. <laughs> So, <laughs> it's crazy. I'm scared of this. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, is it? Is it? Michael's still afraid of. Uh, oh yeah, he is. He's better kind of that thing. He's scared as hell. Because you people don't remember how we went to see a Twister first. That one. You guys were little. No, no. I think. Um, I think I was too little. Yeah, you were too little, but because Michael was like uh, maybe 10, 11 years old. Yeah. And Dad decided to put us right up the screen. See, that's not that's not funny. You can't do that to little. No, it's not funny. Of course, it's not funny. But he thought that we had the best seats ever. And I think so. I was like, you don't. We're not going to be able to see nothing. And he's like, yeah, this is perfect. This is perfect. And then when uh. When all these things start flying, <coughs> oh my god, Michael was like, yeah. and then <laughs> I'm like, it's not gonna come down. And yeah, every time something flew, it is. Oh, there it is! There it is! There it is! Yeah, but then after that, when we and then, yeah, after that, I think like two months later, we had yeah. the microburst. Yeah, I, I remember, like, like we were all sitting there, and then you know, Michael was literally at the window, he was like this, like, uh -huh. like a weird. And then it got quiet. Michael ran to the door. He rips it open. He looks up. I remember, like, we all went out of the house. The sky went from green real fast. And maybe, like, 20 minutes later, it went purple, pink, and then black. Then Michael goes, we have to get inside now. David's like, no, no, we're good. He goes, everybody inside now. It's a good thing because... After that, you know, yep. it got so windy and everything, and, uh -huh. the power went and then, out. you know, Michael called you and everything, and, oh, then, yeah. I was and then after that, after your phone call, we were sitting there, you know, lights are still on, and then all we heard was, <laughs> the, the electric, the gas, the everything, everything and then we just heard, like, the whole house was shaking, luckily the house was made of bricks, yeah, like a brick so house, because, like yeah, this. yeah, it was like the three little pigs. Okay, we have the strongest house. We're the third brother yeah, house, okay? No, no that, so, that's crazy. That was yeah. crazy. So you came home and then dad came home and then it was like a few days. <laughs> we were just sitting there like... No, because then after that we didn't have power for like five days. Remember that we had to go to the restaurant to eat because we couldn't cook or nothing? Oh, yeah. Yeah. And I, think, uh, I think we actually had to go to... Uh, the Grandma Sally's, the restaurant. That's yeah, the or, uh, no, no, no. I think uh, it's like... Uh, so kind of just something to like yeah, wash up or something? Yeah, no, because we, we had no water. We didn't have no water. We didn't have no water to eat. Nothing. So everything was really crazy. And I was like, oh my God, I hope we're not going to do it again. That's why I'm scared of the storm. I mean, and yet we live out in right. where we live. And now and it's like all the time. open. Yeah, and all the time. Like all the time. But we actually have like a, like a, a bubble. bubble. <laughs> I mean, it, it's not it's not so much of a bubble. Yeah. I mean, more like we still get like really bad rain no, and everything, like, but not. Look at it this way, like the. Probably like home destroying. Yeah, not like the way that the whole city when they had the. Yeah. That was bad. Yeah, that my dumbass friend decided to do what he did, man. Why did he got That is disgusting. Yeah. That's not. Yeah, that's me, not me, not me and him are me and him aren't friends because of that. Yeah. Like ever since then, like. I told him, I was like, you're like lower than life. Like, don't talk to me. Like, yeah. I don't want to be associated with you. Yes. <clears throat> like, 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 who the hell, after a terrible incident like that, right? People and, 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 and you go through the neighborhoods, through their destroyed homes, and loot. And people lose everything. Yeah. And they have to start all over yeah. again. When he got pulled over, the cops were literally found TVs, DVDs, phones, uh, uh, tablets, and everything. And he wanted, he wanted to sit there and be like, 
Well, I, I didn't know the guy I brought with. He, uh, you know, what the guy he brought with him to do that, he knew he was an ex-felon. Like, oh, yeah. what? Of course. They, they already knew what they were doing. They already knew Bullshit. what they were doing because that's Ooh. when you go in a place yeah. like that, that you go in there for a reason. Stupid shit. But like a month prior uh -huh. to him even doing that, I told him, I was like, you're going to get in major trouble. Major trouble if you hang out with this dude. So no, 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 man. Like, like, I have a good read on people. I was like, okay. As soon as he did that, a week later, because he was working security at the time, being a security officer, you can't get any kind of misdemeanor yeah. felony. So as soon as he did that, they revoked his, uh, they revoked his, um, uh, Card, card yeah. and I think he was put on like four year court supervision because well, his, I hope um, he learned his lesson his, because his, he's a dumbass. His, because his father. Oh uh, uh, yeah, no, that kind of children dumbasses, they think they are but, untouchable. But his his his, uh, his dad uh, may have learned the hard way. Good because he, he knows he knows that that's not how you yeah. want to use your father to your advantage. Oh no, my father's a cop. Dumbass, you do stupid shit, you go and pay for it. Yeah, like like many times like you'd get pulled over or whatever and he was like uh you know kind of like, oh you know da, da, da. and then he was like oh you know my dad is so and so you know I'd be, oh oh I know your dad I'm, okay good because like come on you know just, no, no, just keep dumbass. it down no, no. after that because it wasn't you know or, or whatever it was state cops. Of course. And state cops you don't, don't even, play. No, no they, don't, they don't have nothing to do with no. this bullshit. That's when they do shit like that. <clears throat> They're using it all to their advantage to do stupid shit. Dumbass. You gonna learn your lesson? You better get your ass and go sit your ass in jail. Yep. And because, you know, his dad is free, he spent maybe less than six hours in the cell. Because his dad, you know, Pull the strings, they forked over some. Yeah, but he's going to go and say, oh yeah, you made a mistake. You made a mistake. But how many times you're going to make a mistake? First time, it's a mistake. Second time, you are dumbass. Yeah, like, it was his first offense ever. Okay, wrong place, wrong time, wrong yeah, crowd of people. Done mis that's no. a mistake. But when you do constant shit, you know what you're doing when you're shithead. I mean, ha have I done stuff? That, oh, yeah. That, you know, well, hey, I'm hey, not hey. proud of, but I have hey. gotten away with it. Uh, your yes. ass gonna get beat. <laughs> like, 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 very quick, I'll tell you a story. Uh, me, him, and, uh, you remember Kat? Yeah. Her, we, uh, thought it would be a great idea to park down the road and walk into Ox Cable Cemetery. Yeah. yeah. Shit. It, 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 it was... hope that dear freaking ass poor dead people will walk around <coughs> and cut the ass out of it. No, I mean, so, you know, we were walking. Apparently, no one told us that the uh, the bridge they installed underneath the bridge are pressure sensors. Uh -huh. So I guess we set those off, but it's a silent sensor, so yeah, let the cops exactly. know, like, hey, there's someone here. Yeah. So we were uh, we're going, and you know we're you know, laughing, joking, where, and I look, and I see headlights, and then I see a searchlight. I go, guys, we gotta go. He goes, oh, uh, what are you talking about? I grab him, I turn him around, I'm like, he goes, oh, so <laughs> we run to like the, the, the wood line, yeah. the trees, fucking okay, I run, and you know, like, we're, we're huddled down, and like, she's, she's starting to like freak out here, right away, so I go, she start. I put my hand over her mouth, I was like, you really need to be quiet, you know, we see the cop, turn, we see, we see the cop turn around, <coughs> he leaves, I go, okay. We waited there, we stood there for like 10 minutes. I was like, he has to be gone now. Yeah, okay. No. So then we get up, <coughs> so I'm going uh, through the bridge, we go around the bridge, so now set it up. So we're on, we go over the hill, we see blinking lights. I go, Rob. He goes, what? I go, we got caught. I go, where did you park your car? He's like, out of the side of the road. I was like, in, right front, of, in front of that dude's house, right? Uh -huh. And he goes, yeah, I was like, so, you know, he runs up, you know, I'm walking, I'm not making it suspicious. I walk up, and, uh, and then he goes, uh, oh, you guys are so lucky, like two minutes later, we, uh, we would call a tow truck. I'm like, oh, so, me, being me, 
you know, like she's all freaking out. She already threw up in front of the cop. And then and the cop looks at her, he's like, is she okay? I was like, she really doesn't like police. And then and she she goes, okay, doing okay. Stupid shit. You know, like Rob's freaking out or whatever. Th this is literally what I did. I was, I was standing there, you know, my hands like this. I look at him. I asked the cop, I was like, can I smoke a cigarette? Like, he goes, yeah. He's like, are you of age? I was like, yeah, I'm like 22. He's like, oh. No. I was like, yeah, no. I'm being smart. I was like, you want to see my ID? Like, I'll show you. He's like, no, no, you're good. I was in there, in there. And then I was finished. I didn't want to like flick it on the ground. I was, so I flicked it out. I was like, I put the cigarette in my pocket. <laughs> And start smoking. Yeah, but here's the thing. So, so I got off of the warning. Yeah. So, so I got off of the warning. She got off of the warning. Rob got a ticket for trespassing. Good. Because it was his car. Because he, you guys were passengers in his car, so he was the one that drove there, and he else. was the one That's with why. the. He was yeah. all right. So he, he got told. So after that, and literally he got like another year added onto his supervision. Yeah. So uh, yeah, that was, that's uh, the interesting story. Uh huh. That's it.